Hey everybody, my name is Blake. I am a sixth year senior at Colorado State University in Fort Collins, Colorado. Um, that's at about an hour north of Denver, for those of you who know that, where that is, and we are in Mountain Standard Time. I'm actually an on-campus student taking some online courses to accommodate my busy work schedule. Um, I study archaeology in the American Southwest in the anthropology department. I got my interest in archaeology and anthropology um, based on most of our family holidays we would take. Grew up in a very large family, a lot of brothers and sisters with very adventurous parents who enjoyed things like rock climbing, whitewater rafting, kayaking, sailing, climbing, canyoneering, backpacking, backcountry skiing, all the works, everything you'd expect from somebody from Colorado. Um, but we take a lot of our trips down to southern Colorado, down in the Dark Canyon, Canyonlands, Grand Canyon area, um, and would go exploring pretty much. We'd find a lot of Anasazi remains, uh, ruins I should say, Ancestral dwellings, lithic, uh, lithic mounds, pottery debitage, um, evidence just of habitation in general. And that really, I thought that was awesome. I thought that was cool. When I learned you could do that as a career, go play in a sandbox. I thought that was awesome too. Most of my siblings are history teachers or environmental conservation teachers um, and uh, work in those fields of study, um, both on campuses and off campuses in and around their communities. Uh, I personally take after my dad, who's a paramedic. I'm an EMT with Poudre Valley Hospital for the, in the University of Colorado Health in, in, uh, here in town in Fort Collins. Um, work about 40 to 80 hours a week, um, generally night shifts, so if I'm ever super tired, that would be why. Um, and I love what I do. I get to talk with people. I get to engage with people, um, see how they interact with each other, with themselves, with me, with their immediate environments, and how, as those environments change and those interactions change, how the people um, then change to adapt to those those. Uh, environmental conditions. I think this class is fascinating for me because I get to blend both my college career uh, and also my professional career um, and kind of see where they meet in the middle, um, see what uh, see what fruit comes out of that, so to speak. Um, see, I hope to go to paramedic school after I graduate in the spring and come back and continue to work in emergency medicine um, and looking at grad school in the future. Um, I want to find out exactly what I want to do in grad school first, so I'm going to go out and get my hands dirty, um, digging in some dirt, finding uh, finding artifacts, um, and then spending the rest of the nine months I have um, in a lab somewhere documenting all those things. Um, interesting fact, um, I love boats. I love the water. Despite growing up on a very inland state, um, I'm actually a Coast Guard captain, uh, or a captain registered with the Coast Guard, I should say. I'm not actually... Um, with uh, with the armed services, but um, I love sailing, love everything to do with that, um, and like to get out to the water as much as I can. So maybe I'll end up on the uh, northwest or down in maybe some more tropical conditions, as it is mm, about 18 degrees right now outside. So uh, I look forward to getting to know um, all you guys um, out there in interwebs, um, and also uh, learning everything there is to know about medical and anthropology um, and this new and very very cool, very unique up and coming uh, anthropological field. So um, hope you guys have a good day and we'll talk to you later.